Our business called The Little Side or TLS is a business of printing customized pre-designed top bags and selling the top bags that designed by our own. One of our reasons to choose this name is because it is unique yet simple name and easy for people to recognize and immediate once they, they saw the our logo. Moreover, the logo is created is simple yet attractive as it has our company name and top bag which is, shows what we are selling. The color in this logo we choose is gold and black because it's our key point of our color which represents the premium of our top bag to attract people to buy our product. By looking at our logo, it already tells the consumer what we are selling and serving the best quality of top bag and they will not regret to join us. Here is our vision and mission. The vision is the little set can create a top bag, the brand that can compete in the fashion industry in Malaysia and then for the mission. To serve Malaysia in the high quality thought bad with an affordable price, to ensure the satisfaction of customers with diverse designs, to provide customer friendly products that can be customized according to the customer preferences. And here is our team member, which is I am Noah Azram Dizun Kofi, is general manager, and administration manager is Siti Noaiza Binti Ramli, financial manager is Nur Fatiha Binti Zulkifli, marketing manager Shami Ilyani Binti Shahruzin. And operation manager is no Alia Natasha Binti Muhammad Lucy. The problems that our business might face is once we operate it, the business is might be the first one is fit printing issues. The second one is the design is based on the trend. So the first solution is giving the best quality of finished goods from printing service to the customers. So the customer will not have to worry about the quality outcome of top bets because we the little set are using special machine to print the design so next solution is about keeping up to the latest trend the meaning of this point is by following all the social media platform in order to know the latest update of the situation we also do the research and surveys to the people in order to know the average preference of their desired design so there are three value proposition for our business the first one is custom made top bags as per customer request. Our top bag specialty is customized pre design that is designed by our customers. We provide short service to our customers because we want them to express themselves in making art and fulfill their preference into a reality. Next is about high quality with an affordable price. The top bag from the little set has high quality materials and outcome from the printing. Not only high quality, but the consumers will get the top bags at an affordable price. This is because we provide top bags with a premium quality and the products are prepared by ski workers. The last point for value proposition is has two types of top bags. Our top bags have two types which are with and without pockets. The customers may choose a customized design or design top bags. We create a variety of options for customers in order to attract them. The little side target market is student, worker and teenager within the Duan Tegan area. We choose this three category as our target market because our product can be used by anyone regardless of gender or age. Students from UITM Duan and Polytechnic Sultan Business Zainal Abidin are our target student. If we combine, there are about 14,000 students. Therefore, we targeted 40% of them, which is 5,712 students. Other than that, Dungan District has 72 schools with 30,205 students. We decided to target teenagers as our target market. Thus, 30% of teenagers, which is 9,061 teenagers are our target market. Lastly, we also have worker as our target market. Since our product is convenient for various use, therefore, there are about 2,700 workers as our target market. Environmental trends that give our target market momentum are trend and culture. This is because third bag are the latest trend and considered as a fashion item that may complete their daily style. Furthermore, third bag are convenient to use, easy to carry everywhere in a daily life as it is light and very useful when you want to use small bag to carry necessary items. Beside that, as our main target market is teenagers who are students, we believe that the impact of the young generation and baby boomers population 
we increase our sales due to the interest and trend nowadays. As competition, we have three competitors which are Tech or Maju Resources, Mr. DIY Hardware, and Flutter Tote Bag. The advantages for Tech or Maju Resources, they provide printing service on variety type of items such as bottle, cap, and clothes. As for Mr. DIY Hardware, they are affordable, well known, outlet, have outlet all around Malaysia and Brunei. As for Flutter Tote Bag, they are unique, have variety type and size of bag. Our strength are we produce only from high quality material and we also we ensure to only produce and sell a high quality product. Secondly, the little set back each of the tote bag ordered by the customer in a bulk that we ensure the condition of the tote bag in a good state and the quality remain the same. Third, the design painted by the little set are all up to date so we will always on track with the customer desire and fashion. We will now move to the marketing strategy. For pricing, we apply the value-based pricing as different type of tote bags will be sold at different selling price. And the competition-based pricing is also applied as we try to set our selling price lower than the competitors. For sales tactic, we pack our product in high-quality packaging box that the customer can also use the box as a storage box. We also provide promo codes on first purchase to encourage customers to repurchase our products again. I will also receive feedbacks from customers to improve our products and services. For service and warranty policy, we have customer services that will entertain customers for any inquiries and we also have written policy that within 7 days of buying date for any damages. As for the advertising and promotion, we use social media platforms and the service of influencer marketing to promote our products online. As for the offline advertisement, we put banners at the side routes. And we also use promo codes to encourage repurchase. And for distributions, we apply the manufacturer to customer method as it is easier for us to make sure the quality of our products remain the same and customer can directly ask for any inquiries. Next, financial projection. This is the projection of income statement of the latest side enterprise for the year 2024. The estimated net income of the tax that we will receive is 8 ringgit. For 2025 is 5,468 ringgit. And for 2026 is 7,154 ringgit. Next, the total cost of this project is 89,044 ringgit. To fund this project, we apply a loan of 40,000 for my bank and all partners contribute a total of 100,000 ringgit. The total amount of capital will be 140,000 ringgit. Lastly, the cash flow of our business will break even when our sales achieve 349,809 ringgit. The time needed for the break even is less than a year. We apply milestone to implement our business strategy and methods. The little set was kicked off on 1st October 2022. Then we tried to get a very business registration license on 15 October. In the next following month, incorporation of venture was implemented on 10 November 2022. On 16 November, we begin to start our research and development for our upcoming product. On 26 December, design and development have been completely flushed without any issue. Next, obtaining of sales representative have been done on 3rd December 2023. In the same month, we also begin signing with the distributors and dealers for our business. Then, we start ordering of materials in production quantities on 25 December 2023. On 13 December, the latest set do the operation planning and also hire employees before starting operation on 1st January 2023. Next, financing sort. As stated before, the total capital for this project amounted to 140,000 ringgit. A loan of 40,000 ringgit will be applied from my bank and a total of 100,000 ringgit will be contributed by all partners. Each partner will contribute the same percentage of capital which is 20%. Therefore, each partner will contribute 20,000 ringgit. The capital will be used to cover the cost of raw materials, machine and equipments, office supplies, monthly expenses and other expenses. 
As for the conclusion, we hope that this business will be able to compete with other competitors since we believe that the little side will always be at the top of the list when the customer has to make a decision on where to buy tote bags. As according to the production plan, we could ensure that we are able to produce only the best out of anything for our products. And I guess that's all from us. Thank you and Assalamualaikum.